Last year, I picked out an unusual herb plant from our local nursery. The name of the plant is Episote, and it's a perennial aromatic herb used in cooking. This year, I researched more about this plant and decided to use this in my zucchini recipe. Hello everyone, welcome to Global Dining. I'm Christina, so let's go check out the ingredients. Here are the ingredients you will need to make my sauteed zucchini and tomatoes. Heat a large heavy bottom saucepan over medium high heat. Then add quarter cup canola oil. Once the oil is hot, add one cup chopped onions. Stir the onions and fry for a couple of minutes. Then add one tablespoon of finely minced garlic. Stir the mixture and cook for one to two minutes more. Next add one cup chopped tomatoes. Stir the mixture well then cook for another two minutes. Then add four cups of large diced zucchini. One teaspoon ground black pepper. Four teaspoon salt. Stir the mixture well. Then turn down the heat to medium low and cook for two more minutes. Next add one tablespoon better than bouillon roasted garlic base. Stir everything well. Then cover and cook for additional eight to 10 minutes or until zucchinis are done to your liking. Make sure to check and stir time to time and adjust the heat as needed. Taste for seasoning. Then turn the heat off. Next add quarter cup rough torn episode leaves and one tablespoon chopped fresh oregano. Gently stir everything together. Then transfer the zucchini mixture to a nice serving bowl and enjoy. This recipe pairs very well with roast chicken or pan fried salmon. I hope you try it and let me know your thoughts. And if you like the written recipe, go to globaldining.com, search for sauteed zucchini and tomatoes. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon.